Jeremiah 33, 3 says, Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and marvelous things which thou knowest not. Good morning. My name is Marcel Goshwe, and I would like to share an experience I had when I visited Trinidad a few years ago to attend a workshop. Now, this workshop was held a fair distance from where I was staying. And to get there, I would normally take a bus and a taxi. Now, coming down to the end of this week, I ran out of local Trinidadian currency. I had just enough money to take the, the bus, which was just part of the journey. That morning, I prayed and I asked God to take me there safely and to work everything out for me in terms of transportation. I joined the bus like every other morning and started the journey. Now, some way along the journey, I realized the bus was not taking the regular route, so you could imagine my alarm. And I asked the conductor, and she told me that I had taken the wrong bus, and this bus was not going the regular route. At this point, now I'm beginning to panic. I was let off in an unfamiliar place, in a busy thoroughfare, and so naturally I was alarmed and I panicked. But something said to me, just look in the other direction, and I did. And much to my surprise and delight, I saw a familiar landmark, which told me that I was in an area quite close to where the class was held. I followed this landmark and I was able to gain a sense of direction and I found my way to the location. And what I discovered that where I was put off was exactly at the point that would have allowed me to see this landmark. It was exactly the point that would have allowed me to find my way to the class. So even in this, I saw God's working things out. Even in this situation, I saw God working things out for me and directing the path. What seemed like a detour or a direction that was missed was actually God, God's detour to actually bring me closer to the class. In that situation, what I discovered, I saved money and I got to class half an hour earlier. God was indeed faithful and he worked things out for me so that I would get there safely and on time. Now that experience taught me to trust God in every situation and with everything. God sees the big picture. We are only able to see the small view of things. He would see all the options that are available and he can direct us to that option that is best for us. So this morning, I want to encourage you to trust God in every situation and to ask him and call upon him always.